Hello everybody. Today we'll be taking an in-depth look at the new post and draft post tabs. We'll go ahead and start with the new post tab. This is where you'll do the majority of your posting within eClincher. As you can see, you'll have the ability to select which account you'd like to post to, and you can post a one or multiple accounts at once. For this example, we'll go ahead and we'll select a Facebook account, and we'll go ahead and paste in a link that we grabbed earlier. Now, as you can see, it's going to go ahead and create the preview just like you would see or expect on Facebook. And you'll be able to go ahead and type in your message here. And next, you'll have the option of whether you want to post it now, which will post it live as if you were doing it on the network itself. And you'll also have the option to schedule it. Let's go ahead and schedule this message. So we're going to go ahead and pick a day. Let's pick a day later next week. Now, as you can see, as I click on this day, the day preview over here is going to go ahead and change. So it's going to automatically show me what's going on on this day. So for example, to this Facebook account, we have no posts going out on this day. So this would be a perfect time to schedule a post. So let's go ahead and we'll select 9.50 a.m. and we'll add it to the schedule. Now if we want to schedule it more than once, we could do that. We could find another date and go ahead and schedule it again. As you can see, the preview over here is going to continue to change as you move so that you can easily see what's going on on each day and decide where the best time and day is to post. For this example, we're going to go ahead and schedule this and we're going to move on. So as you can see over here, you have a calendar view. We call this the smart calendar because a lot of the things in here are automated. As I showed you earlier, selecting account here will automatically filter the calendar. Selecting dates down here will automatically change the calendar and day preview accordingly. But you also have the ability to filter manually here by one or multiple accounts, as well as look into the past and of the future to see what you have that's going to be posted or has already been posted. For example, we could go back to November and find a post that was relevant and try to share it again. Now as you can see it automatically opens in the publisher and the same goes for post in the future. If you wanted to edit something before it got posted you could easily do so from here. You can also open these posts and easily share them to other networks as well. Now also built into the new post is a few built-in design tools. One of those design tools is Canva, which allows you to create custom images. One of the best things about Canva is their preset templates for social media. For example, if you're posting to Twitter, you're going to want a different size image than if you're posting to Facebook. With Canva, it makes it easy. You simply click on the network you would like, and you'll get a pre-sized template and millions of pictures and elements to choose from. We also support Giphy, which gives you access to millions of GIFs as you can see here. It's very easy to search for anything that you would like. And like I said, they have over a million GIFs, so no matter what you're looking for, you'll probably find it here. Let's also take a quick look at the Draft Post tab. Now before we go to the Draft Post tab, I'd just like to point out the Save as Draft button. Whenever you're creating a post in the New Post tab, or elsewhere in eClincher, you'll have the ability to save it as a draft. When you do that, it'll be saved in the Draft Post tab, where you'll have quick access. Now, as you can see, the publishing area has carried over to Draft Post, which makes it very easy to open one of these posts up and easily schedule it from here. So as you can see, the New Post and Draft Post tabs give you a very easy way to schedule posts to all of your social accounts as well as keep an eye on what you're posting. If you're posting too much of something or not enough of something else, you'll easily be able to see it in the calendar and adjust as necessary. I hope that you found this very useful and I encourage you to watch our other videos to learn more of what eClincher can offer. Thank you and have a great day.